All right, we are so excited. We are in the beta of Go Live in the Hive, and I'm going to show you the steps to get your event listed. First, of course, is you need to have created a group that is done through the Me tab. When you click down here, you go to Beehive Groups and you create a group. Now that you have a group, um, you're actually going to see a lot of different tabs in this new section. The My Groups tab lists the groups that you are doing. The Groups tab are listing the groups you are a part of. Live events are the events that are going on right now. My events are events that you have coming up. And events are other versions of events that are going on that maybe you'd like to sign up for, okay? So once you've established that, you want to set your event up. So let's say you're going to now go to the new beta version of events. You will click on here and you can cl create an event. And so you'll need your event title. You will select a group and that's where you're going to broadcast. So let's say I want to do something to Connections to Freedom. You will select a category that you uh, believe it would slot in. This is going to help with search purposes. So let's say somebody is looking for a event connected to speaking, social media marketing. That's what I could do a broadcast on. You can uh, list here the date of the event and the time of the event. Then you will have your event description and your video type. You can just say it's either promotional, Vimeo, or just a replay. Here is where your Zoom meeting will go. Okay, so this is, um, this comes from the Zoom link. All right, so it's a little trickier. So let's say you are going to go to, let's go here and say you are going to set up your meeting in Zoom. And I will just go, I probably have to, oh good, okay. So let's say I'm doing the uh, broadcasting tomorrow. Let's say it's gonna start at 8.30. So see this webinar ID right here, that's what you would put for that number, okay, for the webinar uh, ID or the meeting ID. And of course, this is the link you need to grab for the Zoom. And then you can easily just uh, go through it that way. So that's how you uh, locate uh, what you're working on there. And then you'll want to go back to copy those fields into on. And so you'd copy that meeting ID, you'd copy that Zoom link. Now the status is you want it to be published. And you can also put some search terms here. So let's say I wanted to say, oh, I'm going to talk about online marketing and social media. And I'll talk a little bit about uh, getting published, wh whatever you want, right? Think of things that people are searching for. Is this event country specific? I'm gonna say no, everyone can watch in. A detailed description. Okay, so notice we have 500 characters here. And then you will have your start and end date. Uh, notifications, would you like those to get out? I always say yes, I'd like everybody to be notified. And then does, does anyone need to register? So you think of this in terms of perhaps a meeting versus a webinar. And in our case, um, I always like registration. I like to see who, who's taking a look at something. And so you want that to occur. And then you'll click, just click Save Changes. Now you'll notice here too, it's looking for an image. Um, so you can just uh, create an image as well, put something nice and simple there, um, and then upload it, okay? And then your show is good to go, and I look forward to seeing you live in the hive.